Taking a look at today's energy markets, let's check in on WTI crude futures today as they're realizing some selling pressure here for a second day. We're seeing them down better than 2% currently, right around the 60 spot 30 level. That's coming off an intraday high of 62 spot 92. So we did see them up initially this morning, but selling pressure throughout the day and now basically at the low end of the range for today's price action and uh, pushing them back down towards that $60 level. And so I think when you look at some of the driving factors today. I think there's a couple things I think you can point to as we move into this week that the markets may be a little bit concerned about. Number one, the OPEC plus meeting coming up later this week. Over the weekend, it did appear that there are some storylines out there formulating to the idea that OPEC and OPEC plus might have to step up production a little bit as it does appear that some of the supply chain issues are persistent here. And with that, it does feel that maybe there's some hedging going on ahead of this OPEC plus meeting that possibly we could see a different narrative than what the market was anticipating just a couple of weeks ago. So I think that's one factor why we're seeing some continued weakness. Couple that with the dollar continuing to show strength as well. US dollar now up above 91. Uh, that's basically a new high here or a new recent high, I should say, after we did see some selling pressure a few weeks ago. So that trend shift i think is also having an impact here on the pricing of wti crude futures uh so a couple of things here that are shifting as we move into this week's price action and when you look at uh, the energy market as a whole we're basically seeing a pretty quiet day when you look at natural gas futures they're holding right around the two spot seven eight levels so not too much uh volatility there but we are seeing some volatility within the WTI space and it is interesting when you look at the CVOL measure of implied volatility on the options on those futures we are seeing that now popping up I was trending lower last week but now after two days of selling we are seeing that pushing back up now and up, up, up into the mid 40s so there's certainly an increase here of implied volatility in the options on the futures on WTI as we have now realized the second day of selling pressure. Thank <laughs> you.